Good morning, my fellow artists. It is Saturday about 10 in the morning. Um, I just wanted to show you guys what I was working on last night. Uh, I was working on consolidating down my two kits back here. Um, I want to get uh, all three into these two if I can. Uh, also, because um, I have a new kit coming on Tuesday. That way I know everything will fit. I'm just going to take out everything I hardly use anymore. Um, I also went ahead and depotted all of my ColourPop shadows and I put it down in this extra large um, Makeup Forever palette. Uh, this holds about 55 ColourPop shadows. And then I found my old one. <laughs> Big difference. I kind of like this. Uh, I like this aesthetic better because you can see through, but these are all my cool tones. And then in here are all my warm tones. As you can see. Oh yeah, I was working on that last night. Um, I'm also going to be doing um, product reviews on the LYS foundation. Also the... Um, God, I can't even think today. The Face Atelier foundation I want to try out. Um, but yeah... I'm also going to be doing a week in my life instead of a day in my life. That way there's not so many vlogs on this channel. Um, it's kind of hard because um, when I do an actual video video, I have to do it at night when the little ones are asleep. Um, but yeah, that's what I have in the works. Just a more of a cleaning day, if anything. I have to catch up on my laundry and all that good stuff. So here is my first case. This is contains all my skincare and then extra disposables because at the last wedding, I ran out of a lot of disposables. So now I'm sure to bring extra, extra. So here I have eyeliner and mascara back here. I have my Nano Mister, my Peach Fuzz Remover, um, my little roller. This is for um, face cupping. So this helps the blood flow um, the day of the wedding so she, her skin looks more glowy. And then I have, you know, all my goodies. This is basically for my bridal parties. Um, these are setting sprays. They're face cleansing. I have two. Uh, this is the Tatcha Indigo Cream. This is for sensitive skin. And then I have the water cream down here. This is the water cream. I love this stuff too. And then down there is the rose from Fresh. So in here, there are also some eye patches and some face um, masks. And then over here on the side, again, it's more disposable. So I have my spatulas and then my Q-tips. In my tutor case, we have my facial cloths. Those are really nice. My light, this is my temp tube case. Over here is all of my, my mascara, not my mascara, my eyelash curlers. Everybody gets their own. And then at the bottom here, is my brushes and my uh, sterilized uh, tools. In this kit, again, we have our sponges, our disposables, um, a little portable trash can mirror, and then in here I have all my all my tools and goodies that I use um, cleaning, more disposables because again I ran out and I don't want that to happen again. And that little black case are my little makeup bullets. Here are the pods for the temp two. And then in here is like just emergency stuff. You got your first aid, lotion, some Advil, Tylenol. You know, just those little things you need just in case. So here's the main kit that I was organizing. Oh, you can see my trash here on the floor. But um, I want to try to even condense even more. So that way um, when the new kit gets here, I will just can fit all everything in just to one. Um, but here are my glows, concealers, powders. I've got more um, powder foundation. These are all my foundations. I got some Temp2. This is the RCMA. And then these were the new... Sorry, these are the new um, Face Atelier. I haven't tried these out yet, but I will. And then this is the foundation that I've, uh, my go-to is the MAC Face and Body. I just find it's really light you know, on the skin. Um, so I just put it in one of those containers too. And then here I have the 
Makeup Forever Foundation and Cheek in one. Here's my Temp2 gun. Again, some Temp2s. Here are my setting powders. This is the Eye Brightening from Laura Mercier. And then these two are Laura Mercier. It's that new uh, Celtic... No. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, the Celtic Light. And then this is just the original translucent powder. Here are some clean cream brushes, some highlighters. We got some blushes. My favorite highlighter. Back here I have all my eye toppers that I know I always reach for. These are the ColourPop um, Soda Pop um, quads. I think these are so pretty. They're really for actually a bridal look. Like... You could create so many bridal looks with all these. So those were like, and I have bronzers here, some lipsticks, that are my go-to lipsticks, more bronzers. And then up here, I keep a lot of my lip liners, my go-to lip glosses, my eyeliners, mascaras, the tinted uh, brow gel, my bases, and then just some extras. I got some scissors, clips. So yeah, that was the main kit. Good morning, my fellow artists. It is Tuesday. It's like close to 12. Um, my new kit arrived and I can't wait to open it up and show you. So here is the kit. I am excited. Um, the wheels are so much better than my old one. My old one kept getting stuck because it's only um, it only has two wheels. So it's like it would get stuck. But this one has four wheels. So it's great. It's like that luggage type. Is my skincare uh, kit. Um, not a lot has changed. I just added another one of my facial radiance pads as well as um, a lip therapy in here. Um, but I did put all of my disposables here on this side and then on this side I went ahead and put all of my um, lashes for my bridal parties so this one pretty much did the same then I put all of my brush cleaners my um, disinfected sprays and then my distilled water in one of the side pouches and the other side pouch I put the temp 2 stuff 
I couldn't find a spot for that big old case, so I had to take it all out. But here are my primers, foundations, cheeks, and highlight. And then so in again, the this is my eyes and uh, lip case. Up here we have eyeliners. Um, these are great for brows. This is my tinted mascara gel. Uh, mascaras, here are my eye bases, my lips, my pomade. Um, and then in this little case, I put all of my my toppers, my um, eyeliners, uh, my bases. Uh, so I put those in that. And then the ones I normally reach for are my, tar my Tarlet palettes from Tarte. And then I put my Makeup Geeks and then my ColourPop in here. And then in, I had to add my backpack because, again, I couldn't fit everything in the case, but that's okay. So right here are my uh, bridal brushes, strictly for the bride. Now this is, my backpack is my face um, kit. So again, here are all my, um, sh my glows, concealers, my um, translucent powders. Here are my foundation powders, as well as my uh, can of glows. These are blushes in this one. Over here is all foundation. Again, I had to move my temp twos into these little kind of cases. So these are the adjustment colors. Again, here are the temp two already AirPods. This is the the perfect canvas ones. I will be finishing those up. And then my Mac face and body, my face atelier. Again, some more of my um, RCMA foundations right here. And then up here is the Makeup Forever, my gun, and here are all the pods. It's kind of hard to get out. So here are all my pods and the cleaner for the gun. And then in this case is my bronzers. So I have bronzers and highlights. So that's what I keep in that one. So yeah, that was my face kit. I put this back. <laughs> Eyes and lips and then all of my goodies. And let me show you what I have in the big kit. So here is the main kit. What I love about this kit is that um, all you have to do is like set it up on your table and get to work. You just open up, um, open up the main one, it comes down and then everything is there. As well as the top, you can open up the top and get to work. You wouldn't have to detach anything, you just work, which I love. Um, that's one of the main reason I like this kit is because it is very functional. Again, all you have to do is put it up on a table and you're good to go. Um, right here um, is a big old pouch and inside is my hand sanitizer. So I went out and purchased a new one because I was running low. So here is um, some hand, san hand sanitizer. I also have a mirror. And then just a portable trash can. So in this compartment, I have some pins, my disposables, and then my sponges. And then I have extra disposables right down in here. So what I keep in the main one, again, it comes all the way down. So you just open it up and bam, you just get to work. Um, here I have my bridal uh, makeup kit. So. On the day of the wedding, I just pulled this out uh, for my bride. It has all her products in that we used for her trial, and she's good to go. We have my Glam Core Light, my Reby Matte, and then in here I have, I used all my little Zuka cases. So these are all my little um, accessories for myself. So like my fan, my um, makeup bullets, some breath mints, all that good stuff um, and then in this little guy I keep all of my cleaning tools for sanitizing my station um, let me keep going in here I keep like just random things that you don't think you need but I had a wedding that I did and the power went out and I had no light so that really sucks so now I just bring this little headlight and then in the back I have a um, extension cord so here are my extra bridal uh, brushes all of these are my uh, individual brush uh, sets for each client here are my um, 
sterilized tools. So that's what I keep in there. So this is more like um, tools and whatnot. Um, here in the main, I have my facial um, tissues. Here are some lotion, Tide to Go pen, Tylenol Advil. In this little case are individual eye drops. I totally recommend getting individuals for anybody's eyes that are dry. Here, just like a, a manicure kit. I have some nail polish just in case. This is a first aid kit and then, then a lip roller. Yeah, so that was my completed kit. I tried to get it all into that just one case, but it was not possible, so I had to bring out the old backpack. Bing. Good morning, my fellow artists. It is Thursday, about 12.50 in the afternoon. Very late start for me. Couldn't get out of bed. Um, but for today, I don't have anything big planned. I do want to go through my uh, work clothes in my closet to kind of get rid of what I don't wear anymore and what doesn't fit. Um, if you didn't know, I broke my closet into two sections, work and then every day. My every day is very colorful. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's what I have planned today. I also bought some more shirts to put my logo on, so I'll be doing that today as well. But yeah, just a very... Um, organizing day to day so so when you come in here is all my everyday clothes i have some stuff in here my purses so this is my work area um these are all my work clothes i think i want to buy some dresses but not right now because i'm trying to save for my little studio which i have little um mood boards i want to share with you guys i even show you guys my old space when i was glamour artistry uh but yeah i'm gonna go through all of this so it's at the end of the night and we just got back from Walmart. Um, I'm also doing a product test on the foundation, the LYS foundation. So far I'm loving how it looks. I love the finish. I love the feel. It just looks like my natural skin, but way better. <laughs> but yeah, we stopped at Walmart. I got a few things. Um, they're having like a big sale right now. I think they're just bringing in their fall stuff. So they're getting rid of all their summer. But I stopped at the men's section and found these muscle tees. Right now they're $4. So I got it in purple, I'm wearing the black, and then I got it in the white. Um, and then I picked up two pairs of jeans. Uh, I picked up these high rise jeans um, in this light colored wash, cause right now these are on sale for $7. And then I found these mommy jeans. These are original price. Love the wash of this jean. And then I love the little um, distress right here at the knees. And then the last things I got were just a couple makeup items. I repurchased the bling bling for myself because I like it that much. I also got some white press-ons and then a liquid eyeliner from Wet n Wild. And then the last thing I got was a brow pencil um, with the, it kind of looks like the Anastasia Beverly Hills, but, uh, but Wet n Wild. So I'm gonna try those out. Uh, but yeah, that's what I got at Walmart. Night, and I am um, ready to take off all of this makeup. As I was looking at the pile of clothes here, I'm looking like, what were you thinking, Cece? You're trying to save for your studio, you silly girl. So I might be taking these back. I don't know why I bought them. Well, I know why, because I wanted them. I guess my wants got ahead of my needs. So I'll be taking these back tomorrow, just minus this one because I already have it on. <sighs> but I also wanted to show you guys my inspiration photos that I wanna do for the studio, as well as a photo of my old studio when I was a uh, glamour artistry. Uh, so yeah, I'll be showing that too. But also doing the product review of the LYS foundation. And so far, I gotta say, I'm liking it, guys. I'm not as shiny as I normally am. And it didn't eat the makeup off my nose as much. I think I was touching my nose earlier and I was wiping it off, so there's breakage here. All that it is is just shine, and that could be blotted away. So I'm pretty amazed. Um, it's really lightweight. Tomorrow I'm going to do more of a medium coverage. And then on the last day, it'll be a full time, full cover. 